Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna show you a Lord inspired makeup from one of the face chart that was created for her by MAC and uh, this is from her new MAC collection that was released uh, sometime in June. So I'm gonna begin by spraying some vitamin D um, toner mist on my face and this, this is kind of um, a way to refresh in my face um, just before my makeup application and then I'm going to apply some BB cream I'm not using foundation I'm using BB cream because my face is in a pretty good condition today so I decided to use a light coverage and this one is by Clinique is age defense BB cream with SPF 30 and um, I'm using a Morphe uh, MB6 brush to buff that into the skin. I like this tinted moisturizer because it stays on even though in Tanzania the, the weather is pretty humid. So um, it also protects me from the sun. And now I'm going to um, just brighten up my under area using MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. And I'm using Hair and Makeup Addiction, the Queen brush, to kind of buff that on the under area and now I'm going to prime my lids to ensure the eyeshadow stays in place throughout the day I'm using Lime Crime eyeshadow helper and I'm dabbing it on all over the lids and then I'm gonna apply my first shade which is um, Nylon by MAC and I'm gonna mix that with Naked Lunch by MAC and I'm going to just highlight my brow bone using the shade and I'm using Morphe S30 brush to um, just apply that just underneath the brow bone to highlight it. I'm going to take the same shade and just apply that on the tear duct area and this will kind of open up the eyes and just make them appear brighter. And then I'm going to take the same shade just using another brush by Morphe and this one is M422. It's kind of it's a flat shader brush. So, um, the size is pretty big so it's easier to apply, to apply the shade all over the lid. Now I'm taking a Sigma E25 brush and I'm going to take this palette by Morphe um, number 35W and I'm just going to take that bronzy shade and just apply that on the outer part of my eye, just the outer C and that's all she had um, I believe from the face chart that she didn't have any other um, eyeshadow on, she just had like two shades it was pretty light you know there's not much to the eye makeup really it's just um two shades kind of blended well together and um just buffing it really well and now i'm gonna take a smaller brush this one's by morphe again and it's m m408 i'm just applying that on the lower lash line now I'm going to curl my lashes and I'm not wearing any lash false lashes today because um, she doesn't really wear any falses. I haven't seen um, pictures of her wearing any false lashes so I'm just, you know, applying mascara on my natural lashes and they've grown pretty much um, since the last time um, I've shown my natural lashes on the video. They've, I've actually used this serum called uh, Lee Lash and it really helped basically um, extend the, the length of my lashes and also thicken them a little bit. If you've seen my previous videos, they were pretty <laughs> short and um, they weren't this um, full. So I'm applying it on the lower lash line as well. And if they get a little bit clumpy, you can just take um, an eyelash brush and kind of uh, brush it through. And now I'm going to move on to the lips. First I'm lining them using Max Heroin Lip Liner. And I'm going to basically go over the lips with a darker liner. This one is Night Moth by MAC. So mixing the two shades together will kind of give me that dark violet shade that she was wearing. Because I don't have the exact same shade of lipstick that she has. I believe um, it's pure heroin. But I have the old heroin which was released a couple of years ago. So I'm lining my lips and then I'm going to apply the heroin lipstick by MAC just over and this will give me that rich violet shade. The Lord has pretty a pale complexion much like mine so I'm going to apply some blood powder in the shade medium this one's by MAC and I'm applying it using a Morphe MB34 brush. I'm just going to apply it all over my face. Now I'm going to apply some bronzer. 
I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit and a contour brush just to apply that in the hollows of my cheeks and just about the, the sides of my forehead, the top of the forehead as well. Just make sure it's well blended and there's no visible um, lines. Now we're going to apply some blush. I'm using Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush on an angled brush by um, Morphe. And I just got these brushes, they're really, really affordable. I got so many of them, so I decided to use them in this video for whoever wants more affordable brushes. It's an, it's an idea. And now I'm going to highlight my cheekbones. I'm using um, Estee Lauder's Heat Wave and um, this brush by Sigma. It's number F35. I'm just applying it on the highest points of my cheekbones and the bridge of my nose. Time to do my hair. I don't usually do hair tutorial guys, but I just decided to do a quick one just to show you how I got the curls. So I'm going to apply this heat protectant spray by Tresemme and, and then I'm going to use this curling iron by Bombay Hair. And this wand is like this. She doesn't have um, really defined curls, so it's kind of a messy curl. So I'm going to first uh, curl uh, small sections at a time. And then I'm kind of going to brush through the curls to get that loose uh, curly look like she has. And I'm sure you noticed that uh, I've cut my hair. So ever since I tried to change my hair color from black to brown, it was quite a journey because um, I had to bleach my hair and got pretty damaged so I had to cut off uh, quite a bit of it. But I'm just using my oil treatments now and it has grown quite a bit. So let's see. I'm going to have another video just showing you how I grew back my hair as soon as it's grown. So I'm going to tease it a bit to get some volume like a Lordy had. Lord, sorry, I don't know how you pronounce the name. I hope it's Lord. So anyway, this is the final look guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you like this video, don't forget to thumbs up and uh, thank you for suggesting it. And if you have uh, any other requests to see any um, other celebrity looks or whatever uh, kind of looks you guys want you can just leave your comments below and vote on it so um, we'll have another video really soon thank you for watching again i hope you enjoy this and i'll see you all really soon with another look bye guys god bless you see you soon